Beloved of the Great, Buttermilk Biscuit. Not enough rice, honey. Attacking me. You seek God. I mean, what happened to this girl? <laughs> Please don't forget to hit that like. Uh, so in this video, I'm going to show y'all how to use some cheap off-brand shells and cheese, um, macaroni and cheese or whatever you want to call it, and turn it into some delicious baked macaroni and cheese, okay? So these are the ingredients that I'll be using. It's two boxes of great value, premium shells and cheese original. I have some Velveeta cheese sauce packets. I'm only going to be using like one. I'm going to use some... Tostito salsa con queso medium. Um, um, this I use for use it for chip dip or whatever. You can use it for other things. It's, I love this. It's so good. It has so much flavor to it. And I'm going to use some of this Kraft um, natural cheese expertly paired for mac and cheese casseroles. It's got a mozzarella, mozzarella and cheddar combination. Um, that, that's shredded. Okay. So the first thing I'm going to do is take some water and it's a um, pot and I'm going to boil it I put a little bit of salt in there and just a little bit of um, vegetable oil like about a uh, half a cap of vegetable oil just so that my um, noodles don't stick together and I'm going to let that come to a um, boil and then I'm going to add the so now that our water is boiling I'm going to go ahead and add my noodles quick I'm gonna make a quick little apple crisp apple pie type situation just to go alongside my dinner while I'm I went ahead on and drained my noodles now that they are they're are um, cooked but they're not too um they're not too 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 um loose well not loose but they're not too they're firm they're nice and firm but they're not so they're not too soft because you don't want them to be too soft I've drained them I'm gonna go ahead and put them in my casserole dish I'm gonna quickly add four about um, a half a cup of milk to this as well and I'm gonna go ahead and mix this in real good and this is just a regular size little casserole dish y'all just mix that in real good go ahead and add you some black pepper I don't like to put salt in my um, macaroni and cheese because the cheese is salty a little bit anyway you can go ahead on and add some black pepper some parsley if you want to put parsley in there um, if you want to put a little salt put a little salt god darn it um and we'll go ahead and start adding the cheese that came with the, the cheese sauce that came with the macaroni cheese um boxes i'm going to also go ahead and add about a um a third of the jar of this um tostitos um cheese sauce and i'm going to add one packet of the Velveeta cheese sauce and mix that in real good once you mix that real good, I'm going to go ahead and take some of my shredded mozzarella and cheddar. I'm going to put some of that in there and mix it real good. And then I'm going to top it off with some more of the mozzarella and cheddar. All right, so now I'm going to put this in the oven. I have the oven set to 350. I'm going to put this in the oven. The oven is beeping, y'all. Look at how golden and beautiful that macaroni and cheese is looking. And there's my apple crumble pie. Hey, yummy, yummy, y'all. Look at that. Look at that. Nice. Beautiful, y'all. Beautiful. And this is with some cheap boxes of um, store brand, great value shells and cheese, y'all. Look at that. Close doors, I'm a fool for your love.